What's going on, y'all? Um, I wanted to just give a, a, a quick check-in about this CDC vaccine stuff. In the last couple of days, uh, RFK Jr. directed the CDC to update their website to essentially say that vaccines cannot be ruled out as a cause for autism. Um, this is absolutely insane. There's, there's honestly not another word for it. Um, this is insane. This is one guy who has a, for whatever reason, vendetta with vaccines. I don't know if they took his lunch money when he was a kid. I don't know if he, you know, got a swirly in the toilet from vaccines, like whatever. But this guy has some personal beef with vaccinations and apparently with, you know, the safety of children uh, and has decided to uh, make their demise his his full uh, fledged effort. Regardless, uh, this posting by the CDC is incredibly dangerous. I know this because myself and so many of my colleagues are now having these conversations with families on a daily basis to let them know that vaccines are safe because they are asking so many more uh, questions and having so many more concerns. There's no problem with having conversation and questions. It's a level of concern and understandable mistrust that families are coming to us about, about vaccines because they are getting so many mixed messages from people who are supposed to be objective leaders in providing health care for, uh, for children and for families and for all of us here in this country. Uh, this is an unforgivable move by RFK Jr. Uh, this move by the CDC and by RFK Jr. is extremely dangerous. Uh, I just wanted to jump on to say, please get your children their routine vaccinations. You don't want your kid having polio. You don't want your kid having whooping cough. You don't want to live with the idea of your child getting meningitis, bacteria around their brain that leaves them with a potential lifelong disability because RFK Jr. and his goons at the CDC decided that they want to, you know, work out their own childhood issues with us paying the consequences of that. Vaccines are safe. We have studied vaccines. Of all the possible causes for potential rises in autism levels, vaccines are the thing that we have actually studied the most. And so I highly encourage you, talk to your doctor, but get your child their routine vaccinations, please. All right, my friends. I'll let you guys later.